Thank you for watching Studio 7 from the Permian Basin Chevy Dealers. So let's get started today with an important conversation about your teeth. Missing teeth aid you even if you can't see the gap in your smile line, even if they are in the back of your mouth. In today's Ageless Beauty, we have a must-see, absolutely miraculous smile makeover. Dr. Robin Rutherford at the Art of Dentistry always amazes us with the cosmetic dentistry that can literally turn back time. Thanks for being here with us today. Glad to. We're going to talk today about missing teeth. Um, this is a sure way to make you look older, right? Yeah. And, and this is a misconception here. Well, and we talk about ageless beauty and looking nice and everything. Well, yeah, this is a perfect way if you want to look older and sicker instead of more healthy and young. Yeah. Okay, is to start losing your teeth. And I'm talking about back teeth. And I'm going to get on my soapbox here just for a okay. second. Continually, people that come to see me do not have a qualm at all about losing back teeth. They go, oh, it's just one tooth. Wouldn't it be cheaper just to pull it? They're missing teeth. A lot of people that I meet are already missing teeth. It doesn't show anyway. It's in the back. Who cares? What's the difference? Right. Well, I'm going to show you what difference that it makes. So I have a photo of an x-ray here. When you look at this picture on the lower right, see between the two teeth. Yes. The level of the bone is what I'm trying to show. Look behind the back tooth and you can see the bone level that should be. And can you see how it dips down? Down yes. in between those two teeth. When you lose a tooth, the only reason your body keeps that bone there is to support the tooth. Okay. To support that tooth, and when the tooth is no longer there, your body says, eh, why make the effort, you know? Yeah. When I, let's say I take out a tooth, okay. the bone is level, the thing that you want to do at that point is to replace the tooth, like with an implant, okay. then in there, because your body thinks an implant is a tooth. Okay. And so it keeps the bone there. It keeps it around. It has a reason. And as we're going to see in this next picture, if you mm -hmm. don't, this is what happens, right? right. And this is, <clears throat> I mean, talk about aging someone quickly. Right. So I've been talking about, okay, here's one tooth missing, and the other side, there was a couple of teeth missing. Okay. Here is a diagram. It's not a photo, but it's close, of what happens when you lose all of your lower teeth in this case. Look at the top and look from left to center to right. What your lower jaw is supposed to look like, the thickness of the bone when you have your teeth. And then the middle photo shows the teeth are gone and the bone is not as tall, mm -hmm. is it? And look to the right, it's going down to the point where literally that jaw bone in the front, in the chin, is probably about as thick as my little finger. Wow. And I have seen patients with the bone being similar to a pencil. Okay, right? so this is a great story now. We're going to show you somebody who, a lot of people would look at this picture and say, if, you, if it's gotten this bad, it can't be fixed. This is a great story of, oh, yes, it can. Okay. Now, I always be truthful on this. This is not my patient. Okay. I got it from a dental journal, but it had such good photos yes. that I borrowed them. But this is Heather, but okay. she had a lot of decay. She had already lost about half of her teeth, and what was left on the left, above them, the uppers and the lowers, a lot of them were pretty rotted. Wow. And so they kept what teeth they could with root canals and crowns, fixed them, uh, and then replace the things that needed to be replaced with implants. So here it is on the right being, you know, crown and bridge. Wow. Okay. Now look at the photo of the same person after her teeth were fixed. This blows me away. It's an amazing difference. I mean, you wouldn't know it's the same girl. She looks smart. She looks nice. On the left, yeah. The literal story of Heather, she said that she was reduced to getting nothing but menial, low-paying jobs. Yeah. And do not lose your teeth. Yeah. Do not go and down that road. And that's the moral of the story today is, even if they're in the back, it's not okay. Don't lose the first tooth. It's a remarkable image and a reality that a lot of people face. Thank you so much. This is very hopeful. No matter how bad you think your smile is, this is what you do day in, day out. Help mm -hmm. people find their confidence again. Yeah, this is very typical for the dentistry that I do and that we can do nowadays. Yeah, it's inspiring. Yeah. Dr. Rutherford, thanks for being here with us today. I'm Thank glad you. to.